Hi guys, welcome to Kumar Consulting. So guys, here in this session, I'll explain what is purchase requisition. And guys, this is a short video, so of course, I'll be having time restrictions, so I'll be explaining in brief itself, theoretically and practically both. Now, purchase requisition, look at here what is written. It is a formal request within the organization to procure a particular material or even services also. It's internal document that notify the purchasing department that certain quantity of material is needed you know by a particular date now i'll tell you one thing guys let's suppose tata motor itself tata motor if tata or any organizations if they have to manufacture a particular things of course they need multiple different different kind of raw materials so raw materials means uh, that is going to be procured from somewhere right certain quantities are st you know available in the stock but what will happen if it is going to you know reach a particular threshold limit let's suppose uh, only 10 quantity or 20 quantity or 30 quantities are there in the stock. Of course, that need to be procured. So now direct procurement is not possible, guys. First of all, certain process is there. Process means, first of all, approval is needed, right? So from higher level. So what will happen? Approval means uh, somebody is not going to talk directly to the management. So here PR purchase requisitions will be created. Okay. So this purchase requisition consists of like what should be procured, which material need to be procured, how much quantity is needed, by which date this material is, you know, uh, going to be procured, supposed to be procured, from which source it is going to be procured. So all the details will be there in the purchase requisitions. Now look at here, it is a formal request within the organizations to procure a particular materials. It is internal document that notify, inform the purchase department that certain quantity of material is needed by a particular date this is what they use now how to create the purchase requisitions look at here i'll just do one thing once again i'll use me 51 n is the transaction code by which we can create now this is a short video here screen is coming half only so i'll click on source determinations first of all so automatically source will be determined by system here you can enter your material master i'll have given the material master here and then here we can enter the plant. Let's suppose I'll give TM2D. This is my plant. Apart from this, we are having storage locations. So here we can enter the storage locations. Right. And once you press enter, then the source determinations will happen automatically. If already you are having, okay, enter. Okay, a quantity I have forgotten to enter, guys. Right, so I have to enter the quantity also. Quantity, let's suppose 10 quantity, and then press enter. Now, system will identify the source, and this is how it is created.